the, the hostel worker um, identified him from um, seeing his image on the internet. Um, I don't know what made us suspicious at all. Um, all I know is that um, he was identified from a picture on the internet um, and then called the local authorities in Luxembourg. It's around midnight, so we're not quite sure in terms of UK or, or Luxembourg um, time, whether it was um, yesterday or today, but around midnight time yesterday. Um, there's, there's clearly an element of relief. Um, there's been a huge amount of work, not just in the UK, but with the assistance of National Crime Agency colleagues um, and colleagues um, throughout Europe. Um, so locating is also a significant development for the investigation. Uh, we've met nothing but excellent cooperation um, throughout the whole of Europe, so it's been superb. Yes, we, um, he will be um, detained locally. Um, he will be going before, before a local court, and that's where the extradition process commences. So, sorry if I'm asking the obvious here. So he's a Kosovo national... Is he, was he here on an asylum basis or illegally, do we know? Okay, we're now going um, right back in time to when he initially came to the UK. Yeah. Um, so he reported um, as someone who was seeking asylum and was going to the British passport.